Hello friends, this video on alcohol phenols and ethers part 6 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Similarly, let's see this now. CH3, OH, CH3. So, OH is my primary. I'll put it 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So, at 2 and 4, I have methyl group. So, it is 2, 4, dimethyl and this is phenol. Correct? 2, 4, dimethyl, phenol. Let's say this. So, again, this is OH is my primary. So, I'll number this 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. This is the longest chain. Correct. So, let's start the name. This is chloro. This is methyl. So, let's see. This is chloro. Chloro. This is methyl. Let's start with A, B, C. C comes first. So, it is 4 chloro. And this is done. 3, 2, 3 dimethyl. 2, 3. Dimethyl and meth is probutpen pentanol. Right, this is my compound, or you can say pentan one all also. You can say why right? because the OH is attached to first carbon, so it will be 4 chloro 2 3 dimethyl pentan one all. Let's take some few more examples. So this is my, my straight OH should be there in the chain because of the primary group because OH, CH3 and Cl out of that OH is the primary group. So this is my straight chain. Let me find this biggest chain. I can take this as the biggest chain. This is 1, 2, 3, 4. Four, five. Correct. So I have in this this CH two Cl is what chloromethyl. Chloromethyl. Then I have this compound with it prop isopropyl, but I'll have add propyl only here, right? Because Iso, di, tri doesn't make any difference. So I have propyl and chloromethyl, right? So A, B, C, C comes first. So I'll write here. This is the third position, right? This is the third position, which is 3 chloromethyl. And then 2, I have isopropyl. 2 isopropyl. And total is 5 carbon. So pent all single bond in and OH is at position 1, 1 all. It is 3 chloromethyl, 2 isopropyl, paint in 1 all. That is the name of this compound. Let's see this. This here also I have OH group and CS3 group. There is OH is the main group. So let's start create the longest chain. This is my longest chain. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Correct. So OH you can ignore because that is the primary one. I'll write the last. I have methyl group at 2 and 5. So it is 2, 5 dimethyl. And then 6 carbon. Right. So hex. All single bond in. And then at 1 and 3 I have oxygen. 1, 3 thiol. This will be the name of this compound 2,5-dimethyl hexane-1,3-dimethyl. Let's take a few more. I'll ask you guys to pause some time and try to solve things on your own. If, and then you can tally the answers. So let's see this OH is the primary one. So it will be 1, 2 and 3. I, could, I should not take from this side because else it will be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. It will be 1, 5. So 1, 5 is... 1, 3 is better than 1, 5. So I'll take this numbering conventions. So this will be uh, at 3 I have bromo. 3 bromo. 
this is cyclo one two three four five sorry one two three four five six six one all so it is six and one all there so three bromo cyclo x and one all let's say this is the longest chain i have let's number this one two three four so i have a br group here and methyl group here so out of bromo and methyl let's see who comes first a b is a b bromo comes first so let's write the name at second i have a bromo group so two bromo at three have a methyl group three methyl then meth it pro but but all single bond no i have at second position double bond q2 in and one position i have oh group one all this will be the name of the compound two bromo three methyl but two in one all so really let's see this here i had need oh group so i'll take this guy as the longest chain i can numbering from 1 2 3 this way or 1 2 3 4 so if i number from right to left the oh group comes at fourth position and left to right oh group comes at third position this is better also my double bond comes at second first position that is also better so you want to know more about the numbering watch my videos on hydrocarbon where we explain so many examples uh to understand the numbering process so this is the num number process will follow here so here we have uh, hex at 1 i have in one in and at 3 i have all three all this is the name hex one in all one in three all so not that difficult the more you practice the better it will be for you we'll take some more example So let's start with this. I have methyl group here, a long chain here. So this is my parent actually. Correct. So I write here at this is my one. This is two. This is three. At one position I have ethoxy. So ethoxy is done. This side. Now this side is what meth eth pro. But two have a methyl group, so it is two methyl propane. If you see this, this box is nothing but two methyl propane. So it will be ethoxy, two methyl propane. Similarly here, one carbon, three carbon. This is my primary chain. So I have methoxy here. Correct. So I have methoxy here, and this will be number one. This is two number one, one and two. So I have methoxy here, and I have chloro also here, attached to this parent chain. Out of methoxy and chloro, A, B, C, C comes first. So it will be two chloro, one methoxy, meth it. Because there are two chain carbon in the chain, it all single bond A. So it be two chloro, one methoxy ethene. Pretty easy. Let's see this. This is NO two CH four OCH three at para position. That means something like this. This is NO two. In para, I have OCH three attached. In para, I have OCH three attached. I have to name this compound. Obviously, this this OCH three divides compound into two two parts. So this is my primary part here, right? So in this primary part, if you see, I have OCH three at Para position. 
or what we can do is see that so many ways to name this this OCS3 whole thing this whole thing is what any soul and on this any soul if you add at fourth because this OCS3 is primary actually right the functional group this is more important at fourth you have added a nitro group so this becomes four nitro any soul this is one way of naming this this is any soul at fourth position you have added a nitro or you can also tell this as one methoxy four nitro benzene one methoxy four nitro benzene a b c d e f g h i j k l m first so methoxy is first so four one I have methoxy four nitro benzene you can give any other name it's all same let's see this this is my primary it has more carbons so at one I have a methoxy group attached so one methoxy total number of carbon is three with its probe A thank you visit our website examfear.com to watch more and more quality educational videos you can also attend free online tests that are there in our website you can also get access to tons of free study materials and you can also find free tutors and mentors in this website Thanks a lot for watching.